Consultative Council of the Western Alliance meets at The Hague to discuss the situation in Berlin. Britain's Foreign Secretary puts the position to the representatives of Luxembourg, Belgium, Holland and France. The strain of events is told in Mr. Bevin's facial expressions. France's Monsieur Bido, outwardly imperturbable, reflects on the turn of events in his own country, where but a short time ago Premier Schumann welcomed Marshal Montgomery on a visit assumed to be connected with the military aspect of the Western Alliance. Few Frenchmen who watched the impressive Bastille Day Parade failed to recognize that the re-equipped army of France plays a vital part in the defense plans of the Western powers. Yet at this very moment, a vote to reduce expenditure on the armed forces threatened the stability of the French government. World affairs and French politics do not always run on parallel tracks. Yet even to Parisians, it comes as a shock to learn that the government is defeated on the issue and overthrown. Premier Schumann departs, and France returns to political acrobatics at a bad time for Western Europe. 